Hello friends and welcome back. This is my Let's Play Legend of Grimrock 2 episode 34. Um, last time we were messing around with this darn thing. Um, but I think we don't have enough information because it says the answers were sealed in the archives. And I think this, what we have here, this scroll, is not the directions for this, but it's directions for something else in the archive. Which... Where are you? I hear you. There he is. Um, which... <clears throat> we did not fully explore. Um, so we're gonna try it. So we're gonna do our R E Uhu Ko R E Uhu E. Um, we're gonna use that to maybe help us in the archives. So let's see. We have not completed the archives yet. As much as I hate that place. It's time to go back. We're going back. I tell you, having Chris not have to eat is a uh, <laughs> is a very nice perk. <laughs> and I'm, and you know what? He doesn't mind at all. He doesn't miss food one bit. Is what he's told me. Um, the archives, right? Yes. You think I know by now? Anyway, this. This is the place we have not explored. So. R E is one. Ooh. -hoo. Wait. Wait a second. Wait a second. <laughs> R E Ooh. -hoo -co. All right, R E. So E is one. So left one. Uhu ko. This is where I'm screwed. Is it three? If na is two and ko is three. R E. Uhu e. No, that that was wrong. Okay, but that's interesting, huh? Te, uhu na, pala, uhu na, pala na, arhi, famco, lamco. All right, hold on. I'm writing this down. Te, and then uhu na, and then pala, and then uhu. Na and then Palana and then R E and then Fam Co and then Lam Co. All right. Right up to Pala. I don't know what Pala means. And I don't know what Ko means. All right, well, we're going to have to figure that one out. Oh, this is exciting puzzle solving, guys. archives what was the first one it was the provisions I think provisions and then archives oh we never are we are you saying we never went to the archives is that what you're saying <laughs> this whole time uhu na okay um re Okay. 
Uh, Tena. Okay. Lam E. Okay. R. Nah. Alright, well, we're gonna explore a little bit. Okay, let's start. Uhu na. Up two. One, two. Okay. R E. That means left one. Te na over two. One two. Lam E. Back one. R na over two. Bingo. That's for the archives. All right, so we open the door to the archives. So the next thing is this guy. The provisions. I'm going to save. All right, the provisions are te. Tay is turn right. Uhu na would be go up one. Okay. No, would be up two. Okay. Pala. What does pala mean? So Tay is just face a direction, right? Pala. What could pala mean? Could Pala mean? So the next move is Uhu Na. So up one. So Pala wouldn't be turn left. Would it be step back maybe is Pala? No, that would be Lamb. Pala na. Pala na is do a step. So Pala, maybe turn around? No. Take it, no. All right, let's think, let's think. Can't be diagonal, because there's no diagonal movement in this game. So we know it's up, down, left, right. Pala, Pala. It can't be step back. Repeat, maybe? No, not repeat. Because I can't uhu na. I can't te and uhu na again, can I? If I te and uhu na, that wouldn't work. All right. So Pala must mean. Hmm. Step, step back. I'm just, well, I can't be step back. Because it says Pala Na, that would be step back one. Re, re, mm. It can't be start over. It's got to be directions for something. I think Ko is three. Hold on, let me try the other one first. Which was R E Uhu Ko. So that's three. R E Uhu E. Am I remembering it right? Was it R E U E R E? Okay. Maybe Ko isn't three. Maybe Ko is zero. R E U H U E R E U H U Ko. No.
This is a brain buster, guys. What is what does Pala mean? And then fam fam and lamb. So we got Te Uhu Pala. Uhu Pala R Fam Glam. Am I missing more directions? Am I supposed to figure it out? Maybe. Maybe we just check it out and see what's there. Oh, this is bad. I don't like this. We're gonna, we're gonna get leprechauned. Code cracker. Dear visitor, made it this far already? Splendid. Sealed in this vault are the fragments of a tale that tell of a pilgrim from Zaffy. My father passed the story to me, and now it is my time to pass it forward. Alright, well... Then he looked at the path leading that burning hot desert he called home. Alright, so that's not right. He began traveling towards the frozen tundra. The sun was setting. This is the perfect time for something to jump out at us. Alright. So, that's pretty cool. I think we got, these three are definitely the directions for the cemetery. He began traveling towards the frozen tundra. The sun was setting. Then he looked at the path leading to the burning hot desert he called home. Finally, the star of the north came to lead the way, and he continued walking along the path. Alright, that's kind of helpful but we're gonna try to, we're gonna figure this out before we leave we ain't moving until my brain figures this out so we have we know R E alright so we know I'm curious if I bring a notepad onto the screen will you guys be able to see it um Yeah, I think it works. All right. Oops. Hold on. I think I screwed something up. Hello? Okay, sorry about that. I, I screwed up my OBS for a second. Um... Let's pause. And let's think this out. All right. So, you guys are getting the uh, the excitement. Of me figuring this out. All right. So, we got we got directions. We got R. We got Uhu, we got Tay, and we got Lamb, right? So R, we know is west. Uhu, we know is north. Tay, we know is east, and Lamb, we know is south. All right, so we got four cardinal directions, and then we got numbers. So we know that E is one, and what was it? Na. Na is two. So we have Ko as something. So Na, E, Na, E, Na. And then we have Ko, which is unclear. So it's either three or zero. Then the other things we don't have, and these are seem to be directions are Pala, Tham, Pala and Tham. So 
So there's <sighs> there's north, south, east, west. If you're thinking, is it face a direction? No, because it starts off with te. So that means you're facing east. And then uhu na would be up one. So pala and fam, we don't know. I don't think zero is likely. I think three is more likely. So I'm going to go with ko as being three. Now pala and fam are the questions. What do they mean? I don't think that they are abbreviations. But they have directions too, so they can be one, two, or three. So it could be, you can have pala na or fam ko. Uh, who's got torches? Alright. You actually probably don't need torches right now. So let's try this again. So for provisions, it's Te. So we know that Te is. this way. And it doesn't say Tay one, it just says Tay. So R E. So wait, Tay is face this way. Uhu na. Go forward one. Okay. Pala. Means repeat maybe? No, because then if it was repeat, it would be why would there be repeat one? That doesn't make sense. Um go back. Now go back. Hmm. Turn around. No. Uh, this is frustrating. Te. Uhu na. Pala. Pala. Uhu na. Pala na. R e. Famco. Lamco. So I think, I think Pala, Fam, and Lam are all no, Pala, Fam. Pala and Fam are two different things, or opposites. Opposites. Na, 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 na. But then why doesn't R E U H U K O R E U H U E work? Because R E U H U E. Oh, that's why. Because I was doing it backwards. R E U H U E. R E. Uhu ko? No. Uh. R E Uhu ko. R E Uhu e. Take that forward. So maybe ko isn't three? R E Uhu Ko Go Zero. Then R E Uhu E. Yeah, there's some good stuff in there. Well, if we 
can't even figure out what co means. No, because we definitely did this one right. Yeah, that was that was easy. And that definitely was so we got the right idea. I know the idea is right. So maybe All right. Well, I'm going to think about this one some more and uh stick stay tuned. Um and we'll uh, maybe try and figure this out the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you next time.